Welcome everybody. Thank you for being here. My name is Tarek. And together we will go on a journey into love. The love that is present inside your being. And the peace that is present inside your being. So together we will go inside where we can find the source of love. Uh, take a moment to be really comfortable. Make yourself uh, really comfortable if you want to change your seat or it's very good to be grounded like your your feet on the ground you're sitting uh, comfortably connect with your breath come to your presence So what is love? What we are doing is nothing to, to visualize or to, uh, it's not intellectual entertainment. This is a direct experience. And from this experience, you, you may get insights. We are always used to see the outside world and look for things outside. But for this exercise, we're going to go inward to see what we have inside. We may come to find the source of love inside, within, the source of peace. What is love and what is peace? What do you think about love, Rufino? Um, I think love is like a um, emotion. It's um, the emotion that you feel when you have a positive connection with either yourself, somebody else, or a whole group of other people. Sounds really nice. Thank you. And uh, what what is peace to you? Maybe Miral, if you like to share. Mm. Uh, not having stress. Well, then you are peaceful. <laughs> that's, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's very true. Well, what what we are talking about here is. Uh, uh, I, I think when we go inward and find the source of love and peace inside, then uh, this uh, love will shine to the outside world. And I think you can never uh, have a good experience with someone, connect with somebody without having love inside of you. Without love, you'll always be... Uh, not really connecting it's like disconnecting so when we find this uh, uh, love within and this peace within then uh, you really don't need anything outside to to feel good or worthy or comfortable or joyful or happy it's all inside it's all within so we're going to go on this journey to to find out how we can uh, look at this space, how we can find this space. Actually, if you uh, empty yourself, we, we're going to go into a place of emptiness, a place of uh, uh, deep silence. And in this deep silence, we will discover this uh, this love within and this peace within. 
and this will always be with you. This has never left. You always have it inside of you. Uh, everyday life and everyday duties, it may cloud you from seeing this uh, sp spot inside, this uh, flow of love inside, this source of love inside. But it's always there. It never leaves. So I will ask you, we're going to begin the exercise with uh, closing up your eyes so you can focus inside. Listen to your breath. Feel your heart beats. Feel your body. How is your body touching the ground or the seat? Feel your spine. Now I, I'm going to ask you to let go of uh, anything that you, you have been holding on or anything, any thoughts in your head or any expectation, any identity. any role in your, you take in your life as a brother or father or mother, as a man or a woman, as a doctor or engineer or teacher or just any role you have in your life. We learned in the theater to go back to the zero state, where it's totally neutral. Here also, we're going to go back to the zero state. Just like a baby born. All he knows is that he exists. The feeling that you are present, the feeling of I am. Emotions may come. But don't, uh, don't engage with them, don't go with it, don't feed it. Just know that it's there. Thoughts may come, also the same. Don't go on with the, th with the thoughts. If you don't go on with it, it will leave just how it came. In numerology, if you have zero, you can be any other number. 
but if you are six you cannot be one In alchemy, the elements of nature, the fire, the earth, the water, the air, and the ether, those uh, fire and water and earth and air, they cannot exist without the ether, which is the, the empty container for them to be. So here we're going to allow all the elements to be really calm and still so we may come to experience reality from the eyes of the pure awareness the pure ether the pure emptiness Do not identify with any idea, with any concept, with any shape or form. Remain empty. Empty of identification, empty of words. Just the feeling of your presence. You are here, simply here, effortlessly present. Now in this, in this empty space, I want you to look if there's what what can you find is there anything you can still let go of or empty yourself from can you empty yourself a little more Can this feeling of presence be taken away from you? Is it a mood? Is it like a lifestyle or As you go on with life, if you get to a challenging moment, is it going to change this? Even if the situation is painful or hurtful, is it going to even touch this awareness? Was it born? Does it go away if you sleep? Does it die? Whenever you have the chance to be silent with yourself, 
keep on questioning keep on peeling layer after layer keep on going deeper inside yourself know yourself this is what you are This is the true self, the pure awareness. Everything can come and go, it's not you. Everything that can go up and down is not you. You are the unchangeable. You are the unborn. Can you ever be disturbed when you know this, when you know that you have this peace in your heart? It's like you are above everything that is worldly. Everything that is worldly may come and go. But what you are is never changing. Go on with your life as this awareness. This is only the invitation, but Take it from here, take it with you. Sit with yourself in silence every day without distractions. You, you do, do not need, need so, so many of the things, things that, that you do every day, you do not need. You do not need to be entertained. As you go deeper and deeper, you may find that it's a whole universe inside of you. We go in life identified with the person, the name, and the job, and the titles, and all the things. We make ourselves very limited. While we are really infinite. Multidimensional. expression of the universe alive don't live here as the person but live here as the awareness that's how you can really experience what you are experiencing. That's how you can really live in the now. You can really enjoy what's in front of you. That's how you can see beyond 
what is normally seen. You can go deep under the surface. Do not limit yourself with your thoughts and imagination about yourself and what you are facing. Go beyond. Travel within and experience and feel what's inside. You are here to see the sunsets, to enjoy the fruits and the food and the chocolate. We are here to take care of each other, to grow together, to thrive together. Feel free to open your eyes because it does not make a difference if your eyes are closed or open once you are inside. Look around and be familiar with this. Make yourself very familiar with this. You are still here. Simply present. The universe can do to you what he can do through you. So open yourself to the infinite possibilities. How do you feel in this moment? Any one of you would like to share? Does it add something to your experience? Are you excited to to live life from from this space? I feel like uh Uh, 
group space to be reminded of. Yes, we tend to forget that we have this inside. How was your experience, Rufino? Very good. Yeah. I feel so really like powerful when you call me. Let's see. You said powerful. Yeah. It's really powerful to be here, no? Yeah. It feels like you're complete. Yeah. Nice. And how is it for you, Mira? Yeah, I also find it very powerful. I don't really have a lot of words for it, I must say. But I really like being here. <laughs> <laughs> nice to be um, here. Yeah, it's... Uh... Yeah, it's a, a timeless. That's the That's word, really I think. True. And there's a lot of space, which I really like. That's very true. Yeah, in everyday life, we're always, uh, yeah, we, we gotta go, we gotta finish, we gotta do this, we gotta do that. Like, time is really limiting. But in truth, there is no nothing as time time only exists as an idea in reality there's only growth we grow our our physical body grows plants grow life grows our consciousness also grows we learn we find insights we expand our our awareness our consciousness But also, as we go within, we will find all the answers and all the information that we ever need. There is really infinite possibilities, infinite information about the past, the future, what will happen, what happened, everything exists within. Your heart is the portal to the, to the other world, to the infinite world. Our experience on, in life is just like a tiny, tiny journey comparing to the journey of the soul. Thank you very much for sharing and for being here. Uh, if anyone has a question or uh, have any uh, anything to share, please do before we. Thank you, Tarek. Uh, Thank you, Rufino. Thank you, Kobe. Thank you so much. It was very nice. Very good. Very good. The stack, your purpose was for us to fill our hearts, right? Mm -hmm. It's a bit piece of love. Well, for me, it's too much to do. <laughs> Your heart can really shine. Your the peace and the love. It's it's the 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 radiant. It really radiates. I, I, they say that it's the most radiant uh, uh, object in the body. Like it's uh, it's really radiant to to electromagnetic field. It shines without limits to like faster than any light or any. It's really powerful. So keep shining your peace and your love. Open your hearts. 
Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for your time. And thank you for your presence and for your being. You're very welcome. Bye-bye. <laughs>